In this video, we will see how to get the subtitle of a YouTube video. It can be either manually created or auto generated. Using this, you can just pass the subtitle to the chat GPT to get the summary of the YouTube video. So for this, we need to have a YouTube video. In this case, I'm going to choose this YouTube video. This video is about how you can change the face of a YouTube video with just AI. Uh, after you selected the video, then we need to have the video ID. To get the video ID on the YouTube video, just click on these three icons here and click on share. After you click on share, you will get the uh, YouTube link. So you will copy the text I have highlighted in the screen. You can see that just copy the text from the forward after the forward slash up to the question mark. This will be our video ID. So just copy that. This is our video ID. So let's close this. To download the subtitle of a YouTube video, we'll be using something called the YouTube Transcript API. This is a Python model. So we will have to install it. Open your command prompt and type pip install YouTube Transcript API. This is the model that we will be using. So let's give you a few seconds. It will download the model for us. If you get any error like could not install packages due to an OS error. So you will have to use the hyphen hyphen user flag. After you uh, specify this, it will uh, install the model for you. So just close this command prompt and let's open our Python file. Let's import the model that we have installed. So from YouTube. Transcript API. We're going to import the YouTube Transcript API class. After that, I will define a variable called the subtitle equal to YouTube Transcript API. Then we will be call the get transcript function. Inside this get transcript, just pass the video ID that we have copied. So this is our video ID for the YouTube video. Let's print our subtitle. As you can see, we get our subtitle. You can see that it is a dictionary. It contains three key value pairs. First is the text. You can see this is the text. This contains the actual data. Then we have the start key and its value and then duration. This is the subtitle of that YouTube video. You can see that in this video, we'll see how to swap so this is the first uh, line. Then we have the the face of in the video using the. You can want to get the subtitle of more than one video. You can just use the command pass another video ID here. So you can just pass another video ID and you can get the subtitle for as many videos as possible. So I will skip that and if you want to get the specific uh, subtitle, you can pass the languages parameter. So by default, it is switched to English. We change to some. If you want to get the Tamil subtitle, so let's execute this file. So since this video does not have Tamil subtitle, I will get a error that manually created not. So this video only has the English subtitle. That's why I got this error. Uh, no transcriptions were found for this requested language. So if you want, if you use the available uh, subtitle language, it will provide them to you. Uh, next, let us see how to get the, what other transcripts are available. For this, you will have to use the list transcriptions. So let's remove the languages parameter. If you use this list transcription function, this will give us a dictionary, so we will have to use the for loop to get the actual data. So for transcripting subtitle, let's print our transcript. So if you want to get the video ID, you can fetch it from here. So let's run it. As you can see, it returns the video ID of that YouTube video. So if you want to know if that subtitle is auto generator or manually creator, so you can use the is generator. So let's run this file now. As you can see, it returns true. That means this video is auto generator subtitle. Then, if you want to know if this uh, subtitle is 
translate table you can use the is translate table this will return a boolean value so this is not a function this is just a property as you can see it also returns true let us see how to translate that uh, subject into any other language for this we will have to use the translate function so let's uh, use the translate function inside this you will have to pass the language code in this case i will choose tamil as a language code then you will have to use the fetch function to fetch the translator subtitle so let's save this file and run now as you can see the translator subtitle has been returned you can see this video the subtitle is in tamil language now the subtitle has been translated if you want to translate this to a hindi you can choose that as well so hh for hindi language code you can see the subtitle has been translated to hindi this is the power of using the youtube transcript api let us see how to save this subtitle to your file for this we will have to clear this and also use the get subtitle function get transcript function now we will use the with open we are going to open a file called the or uh, in this case face dot the subtitle extension is we can be the srt file or we can be text file in this case i will choose the text file and the under file mode is right so as f let's use a for loop so for line a srt so f dot right so we will use the f string we will write line after that we will pass the new line let's save this file and run it now so it says finish let's open the location of where this python file located if you open the file containing folder let's open our file explorer as you can see this is the text file that we have created as you can see this is the subtitle of the youtube video you can pass this uh, subtitle to the chat gpt to get the summary of that video so this is how you get the subtitle of the youtube video using the python's library this is for this video and i will meet you in the next one